Hello everyone and welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Romy, I'm an interior design student and I'm on my senior year. If you're new here, please make sure to subscribe because I post a lot of lifestyle content like productivity vlogs, college vlogs and things like days in my life. Today's video is going to be a what's in my backpack. As I said earlier, I'm an interior design student and I'm on my last year. After these studies, I'd like to become an architect. I also have got a blog which is interior related. I've got a link down below. My dream for the future is to start my own company as an interior stylist uh, with interior and exterior. For my studies, I don't have any books. I'm using my laptop most of the time and I'm taking my notes while I'm in class. That being said let's jump right into my video so this is my backpack i bought this one last year and i used it last year as well today i'm going to show you what's in here the backpack has got three pockets it has got a front pocket a large pocket and on the back it's got another pocket and in here is one pocket more as well let's start with the front pocket in here i've got a scrunchie when i need to tie up my hair I got as well my earbuds in here. There's no way I'm going to survive one day of class. I've got some lemonade as well in here. And I've got some peppermints as well. That's all that's in my front pocket. Now let's go ahead and open up my larger pocket. The first thing in there is this small booklet. And it's got some sticky notes in it and it says as free as the ocean i love to use those sticky notes in my planner the next thing is my water bottle i bought this one at cna and it was only nine euros i really like this one the next thing is my pencil case in here i've got some markers in purple and in pink i've got three different pencils in here which i'm using for my studies a lot and i've got these five pencils from the HEMA. I've got an eraser in here and a whitener. I also like to get my USB stick with me all the time uh, for whenever I'm using someone else's laptop and then I need to get my documents on my own laptop. I really like to use USB cards. The next thing in my backpack is my wallet. I always am keeping this with me whenever I'm outside of my home. It's got all of my cards in here. Then I've got this really small notepad in here. It divides in a few more spaces so I can take notes uh, for, for every class I'm uh, taking at school. And then I've got my planner. Uh, I also got this one from HEMA. I like to plan everything out in this planner and it goes in every single day. So one page is for, let's say, Tuesday and the next thing is for Wednesday and further on. I really like that my planner has got one page for every single day because I like to write in my to-do list as well. And I plan out everything I'm doing in a week. So I'm planning my YouTube videos, my work days and my school days as well. And whenever I have got some homework or something, I'm going to write it down as well. And the last thing in this big pocket is my laptop. I'm using a MacBook Pro 15 inch and it works very well for me. As I said earlier, I'm an interior design student and everything I'm going to do in classes I do on my laptop. I've got some really tough programs on my laptop like Vectorworks and other things like Photoshop and InDesign. Those are really heavy programs so I love to use my MacBook Pro for it. And further on in my backpack I've got a little zipper here. And and in there is another pencil case but there are no pencils in it but there are some things i like to use like a chapstick a little perfume dispenser so that's everything i've got inside on the back i've got one more zipper which is a really small pocket and in here i've got like two of my face masks they're not really required anymore in the netherlands but i always like to keep them with me for whenever i do need them so that's everything in my backpack i hope you liked this video please make sure to leave a comment down below so we can chat and give me a thumbs up as well see you next time